Frankly, talking hasn't had much of an impact on Jessica's behavior lately. All of Jessica's teachers have spoken to her about one problem or another. That missed classes, tardiness, homework assignments not handed in, but she hasn't improved. Well, in fact, things have gotten worse. Yes, I know. I was called about the uh, smoking in the girls' room and the dress code violations. Exactly. In fact, my... Um, Mr. Buchanan and I, um, we caught Jessie at home with cigarettes a few weeks ago. Your daughter's doing what so many other teenagers do in school, pushing the limits as hard as she can. Surely there must be some way to respond. There is, by pushing back. Mr. and Mrs. Buchanan, I am very sorry to have to tell you this, but I have no choice. I'm suspending Jessica from school for a full week. <laughs> we are going to win best costume at this dance. I hope you know that. Well, we right. better. <laughs> oh, Rebecca? Hey, Kamish, you're uh, back from Fun City, huh? Yeah, the trip wasn't full of that many laughs. Todd was in New York. A waitress from a greasy spoon spotted him, but before the uh, police could catch him, he just disappeared. Are the police going to still look for him? I wouldn't hold my breath that they're going to have any luck. You haven't heard from Todd, have you? Bo, come on. If she had, she would have gone straight to the police. I mean, she was the one who told you he was alive in the first place. Oh, just relax, okay? The only reason I'm asking is that if he tries to make contact, I want to know about it so that... Uh, the trail won't get cold before I find him, okay? Don't worry, Bo. I'll let you know. All right. Thank you. Take care. You're angry. Even worse, you're mistrustful. That's right. Nope. I'm blind. I have to trust. Otherwise, I'd never leave this apartment. So what's your point? Maybe you can trust this girl of yours. Why be so quick to judge her? It could be she didn't betray you at all. You think so? You never know for sure until you find her and ask her. You're right. Sweetheart. Can we talk just for a minute? What do you want to go over? How hopelessly addicted to gambling I am? Right. Or do you want to go over why I'm such an albatross to Serenity Springs one more time? I love you so much, I can barely stand it. When we fight, I feel like I'm gonna break into a million pieces. Look at me. What? I know that you're angry, I, and that's okay, because anger is a, is a feeling just like any other feeling, but we have got to connect. Please don't shut me out. Are you finished? No. Everything I say and everything I do comes from one place. My heart. And my heart is yours. I love you. That's why I care what happens to you. Where are you going? Got a news flash for you. You're the one who's doing the shutting out. I can't get through to you anymore. And as for uh, this uh, loving me more than anything stuff, it, it's, you know, it's kind of hard to buy when you're always siding with court against me. I'm not me. always siding with court. I just, we have a problem. Well, you call it what you want. But I am fed up with you getting in my face about everything I say or do. So you tell Al I'm going away on business for a couple of days, huh? I, uh, 
I thought the uh, California trip was off. What well, is? But I don't want Al to worry. Because the truth is, until we all do a little calming down, I'm moving out. 